on fast today. It's a day that begins with solemn prayer, followed by feasts and gifts. There were so many faithful in Halifax that a building and exhibition park served as a temporary mosque. CTV's Rick Grant has more. There were perhaps by rough estimate a couple of thousand Muslims at Exhibition Park for Eid al-Fatr prayers. For the month of Ramadan, Muslims have been fasting from sunrise to sunset. The main reason why they fast is to feel for the poor. This year in Halifax, Muslims held a charity drive. A plan to fill grocery bags with enough food in each one to feed a person for a day. Gracefully, we actually were able to feed 1,000 plus people. We were told that Eid Fatr means celebrate charity. Feed people, whether those who are in need or your friends, so that there is a sense of community. And that was the central theme of the Imam's message today. It's a community, and it's a community that loves God. And it's community that loves its neighbors. Halifax's Muslim community is huge now, but when Dr. Badethan Katani arrived here 52 years ago from Iraq, the Eid congregation was tiny. At the first prayer we said in a physician's basement, with 16 people who said, oh my goodness. After prayers and sermons, it's time to enjoy Eid. The happiest day that we have in the year. After the Eid prayers end in the morning, then comes the celebration. A feast to break the 30-day fast of Ramadan, and for children, gifts. It's like Christmas, you know, it's like they can't wait till he comes because they get money, they get gifts. Anas and Sarah Sala didn't have to wait to get home to get their $20 Eid allowance. Use it for one of my video games on my mom's iPad. Four generations celebrate at the Sobe home in Portland Estates. The youngest, Yara and Tara, were clutching their gifts. It's like a big party that everybody celebrates. Homemade delicacies on the living room table and the feast waiting in the kitchen. But first, the tradition of giving crisp new bills to everyone. First to the children and then the others. It's a three-day celebration. Families and friends visit one another, but the highlight for these children is a plan to go to a water park and swimming. Rick Grant, CTV News, Halifax. Hey. <laughs> <laughs>